Hi guys, I hope you're all doing great. Today um, in this video I'm going to create this organic looking uh, magical artwork uh, that I titled uh, Pearls of Life uh, using pearl cell uh, recipe technique and um, the materials are going to be in the description below and I will be using a gallery wrapped canvas 10 by 20. Let's get started. Enjoy the video. Hi guys again. Um, so I mix the paints. Let's talk about the canvas first. I am using the gallery wrapped beautiful canvas that I taped in the back. Okay, nice and clean. And uh, so I'm using this uh, holders. I don't know where I found it in my household somewhere. It works for me. So I put this here and I'm leveling. What happened? I'm leveling the surface. Let's see. Okay, leveling. Okay, this is good. Uh, now let's talk about the paint. So all the recipes is going to be below. I mixed um, these colors, but I am not sure that I'm going to use all of them. This one is Tyler. This is the consistency, Tyler Green. That's this is the consistency you're looking for and all the recipes, exact recipes below in the description. Mars Black. Okay, then I'm using, I'm not sure if I should use it. I'm not sure yet, but probably I will. This is beautiful. I just want to try it. Pearl Tangerine Orange with Mica. Really beautiful color. We'll see how it will work. And then I'm using Copper by Artist Lofts. Beautiful too. Um, then I'm using Gold. And I think this was Metallic Gold by Folk Art. Okay. And <laughs> this is a big gamble. I might use this one. This is also by Arteza with um, Mica. It's turquoise, pearl turquoise with Mica. Let's see if it's gonna work. Okay, so those are my colors. We're gonna experiment. And for the base coat, I mix again, see the recipe below. I mix in this big jar, or whatever you call it. This is a um, pearl cell base coat that creates this marvelous pearls. We'll see if it's gonna happen <laughs> today. Okay, and let's get started. Okay. So first, I'm gonna pour the, oh, forgot, gosh, last time I forgot, now I remember. Okay, we're gonna paint this with um, flow acrylic white, and I watched um, Sarah Taylor's video, and she suggests that the paint will land in a, it's going to stick better and will glide better over the canvas if you paint the base coat like that. And I've tried a couple of times and it is true. So let's do this again.
So now we're gonna pour the base coat. Hey, Gucci. It's okay, sit on the sun. Oh, my dog is on the sun. <laughs> my love. It's okay, vitamin D. Torch this. What's this? I don't know where my tweezers are. Okay. Anyway, let's see. So this is done. Next, we're gonna pour paints into the cup. Mars Black, followed by this, Tyler Green, Tyler Green, followed by Bronze. Followed by orange, not orange, tangerine, pearl tangerine. It's a gamble. Still gonna do it. And this one, okay, gold. Let's see. I'm gonna hold down, hold down with turquoise. I don't think it's a good idea. Let's do it in black. Black. Let's do bronze. Okay, so now I'm gonna stretch this.
So what I'm doing, I'm waiting for for the colors to start interacting and breathing with, with each other and see how it's spreading out so I can move the, uh, so I can sort of dance with the design that is already here. And then, uh, yeah. Kind of trying to achieve the organic effect, organic look, earthy, nature like. I think my base coat is thick. Wow. Jesus. My birdie is helping me. Look how loud she is. Oh, thank you, sweetheart. She's singing for us, guys. Oh my God, I love this. I love those color combination. I'm glad I didn't add the um, turquoise. I think it would have ruined it. Wow. I love what's going on here. it 
I wish I can stretch this, but I don't want to ruin this design. I love how this one developed. Less is more. I tend to overplay with it. Let me just stop right here. Oh my God, I wish this would dry like that. Oh gosh. All right, let's, maybe I will torch something, maybe not. This is like a slice of earth. Something like that. Okay. And now, guys, let me take you on a close up adventure. Oh my god, it's so gorgeous. I wish this would dry like that and stop developing. This is. This is just. Wow. I love how everything is emerging. Life is emerging with pearls. So I might need to bring up a little bit more color here. And let's see if I can. This will dry beautifully. So stunning. Wow.
here we are, the painting is dry and it dried really, really well. I absolutely love, I, I didn't even varnish it yet. I'm not sure if I'm gonna varnish or uh, put the resin on top. And this, the streaks of gold and tangerine, pearl tangerine is so beautiful. It came out really, really beautiful. I'm contemplating maybe to do some touch-ups, but I'm not sure. I think it just looks perfect. Let me just... And we have some uh, creature looking at us. I don't know, some uh, beer sitting on, the <laughs> on an island. It came out, I'm really, it, it came out so beautiful, those, um, the silent green is so vibrant, uh, it's interspersed with the gold and pearl tangerine, create this organic beauty and uh, everything seems so fluid and still breathing even in this uh, dry form. You can always look at this painting and see it moving. That's what fluid art form is doing. I absolutely love, 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 love the result. <clears throat> and what's great about this technique, uh, 100 people can do the same thing and it's gonna just, it's just gonna have its own signature. It's always gonna have its own vibe. You can dance with the with this technique. You can just recreate and add and manipulate and morph. And I'm gonna show you um, the images. How it was before. I had more of a thylo a green and like sort of kind of. Um, a beast or, or some cave in the middle. It was so beautiful and then pearls kind of took over but I still love it both ways and actually my friend my friend Stuart saw this painting and he interpreted it as, um, as if new life emerging out of seasonal shifts which I think is a great great interpretation and actually he gave the title, which I'm gonna use, uh, Pearls of Life, which so resonates with this image. I love it. I love it, I love it. Gosh, I love this. And once I put the varnish, everything is gonna pop even more. All the colors, this is dry right now. I hope you guys enjoyed this experiment still learning evolving hopefully and yeah please give me like subscribe and um, support in any way you can and click that notification button so you can see and be notified with my next video and have a beautiful day my loves bye